Good evening, and welcome to those that are joining us at home, online, and watching through Maslin Cable this evening. My name is David Lottenschlager. I proudly serve Washington High School as principal of this great building. It is an absolute honor to, ser to serve in this capacity, and I'm thankful that you're, you're with us this evening to celebrate the achievements of wonderful students this evening. It's been a very odd and, and difficult uh, and different time for, for many of us, obviously, over the course of the last couple of months. But I don't want to lose sight of the most important things, which are our students that we are going to recognize tonight. The students have been resilient. Our staff has been resilient. And I'm very thankful to say that we have adjusted as much as we possibly can to meet the needs of everyone involved. The most, in, the most invaluable thing that I can say to you and to the students that are out there watching is that the, the biggest thing that I miss in the morning and throughout the day is we miss being around the kids. We miss the little things, we miss the hugs, and we miss having those conversations with kids to make an impact every day. However, tonight is an opportunity to connect and to recognize the hard work that so many of these students that walk these halls have been able to put forth this school year. So without further ado, and to make sure we kick off the evening in proper fashion, I would love to welcome Mrs. Parr to the stage at this time. Good evening, and I just want to say hello to all of our Maslin Washington High School students, families, and Maslin community out there watching tonight. Thank you for viewing in and watching this exciting evening. Our first recognition for this evening are our highest honor students. The GPA for our highest honor students is determined by cumulative grades at the end of the first, third, fifth, and seventh semesters. The following students have achieved this honor. Our freshmen, Joseph Abdullah, Nyla Bain, Caitlin Barrett, Mackenzie Biegert, Nicholas Bumgardner, Jarrell Dawson, Anna Ells, Peyton Finley, Coda Gallagher, Braden Geyer, Addie Harper, Caden Hubler, Isaac Huff, Maxwell James, Christian Kring, Jillian Lightfoot, Selena Lopez, Elizabeth Menchez, Zoe Miles, Peyton Miller, Grace Musi, Caitlin Norris, Kathleen Perry, Sophia Philibaum, Morgan Price, Jenna Rothaker, Angelo Salvino, Selena Schaub, Thaddeus Schnecker, Benito Shoup, Tyler Steyer, Sierra Sweat, Ali Vignos, Kendall Wagner. Congratulations to our top freshmen. Our sophomores at this time, Myla Bishop, Aaron Dingler, Caitlin Egan, Grace Erickson, Aaron Fisher, Jacqueline Geckler, Rihanna Gober, Taylor Grant, Grace Knight, Crystal Lynn, Catherine McCabe, Kenneth David Merritt, Lauren Neal, Alex Siebrel, Aaron Shiplett, Alyssa Simmons, Summer Sturm, Ezra Teal, Samuel Wurstler, Mia Woods, and Rachel Wuske. Congratulations to our highest honor sophomores. Our highest honor juniors at this time. Diana Alexander, Alex Bauer, Kaylee Brown, Mackenzie Copeland, Abigail Evans, Antoinette Lackey, Haley Liber, Jordan Ligel, Emily Maxheimer, Amira Mitchell, Evan Peters, Micaiah Smith, Brandon Snedeker, and Jack Vignos. Congratulations to our highest honor juniors. 
And to finish off our highest honor students are our seniors. Emma Bachtel, Jack Bachtel, Haley Beal, Lauren Brown, Caleb Carey, Kiara Cleveland, Charity Daly, Hannah Fry, Madigan Hammer, Lorinda Knipe, Heath Manson, Morgan Manson, Mackenzie Maxheimer, Benjamin MacArthur, Olivia Musi, Emily Neal, Anthony Pedro, Sydney Rice, Bailey Richards, Lauren Snedeker, Caitlin Snodgrass, Aurora Sorrell, Peyton Wagner. Congratulations to our highest honor seniors. Now I'm gonna get into the long list. Some of you may remember this from other years. And I apologize for any um, mispronunciation of any names at this time. Next, we are going to recognize those students who have maintained a GPA of 3.3 or higher during the first three quarters of the 2019-2020 school year. The following students have achieved this recognition. Our freshman names at this time, Joseph Abdullah, Winter Ackerman, Sanaya Andrews, Reese Bachtel, Caleb Bailey, Nyla Bain, Clara Barber, Caitlin Barrett, Mackenzie Bigert, Leah Bentley, Zani Berry, Bryce Blake, Marissa Bohm, Mahogany Bowles Cochran, Kayla Bredenberg, Caroline Bucklew, Nicholas Bumgarner, Sebastian Carey, Dylan Collin, Calix Collins, Thomas Collins, Michaela Cortez Cortez, Megan Corder, Javian Crable, Ava Davis, Mason Dawes, Jarrell Dawson, Chase Duplain, Kynesha Eccles, Anna Ells, Elijah Farrington, Peyton Finley, Addison Ferrero, Jaden Furrer, Coda Gallagher, Victoria Garner, Braden Geyer, Jeremy Guides II, Corin Gowans, Alexander Greer, Xavier Amid, Addie Harper, Kalia Hewitt, Anthony Hilliard Jr., Caden Hubler, Isaac Huff, Carter James, Maxwell James, Shelby Jennings, Jaden Jones, Miriam Joseph, Shannon Kerstetter, Christian King, Jillian Lightfoot, Selena Lopez, Parker Manson, Jasmine Mirziegos Victorio, Isaiah McCullough, Matthew McGeorge, Elizabeth Menchez, Caleb Mercer, Zoe Miles, Melani Miller, Peyton Miller, Race Miller, Robert Morgan, Grace Musi, Tatiana Nelson, Stephen Nickel, Caitlin Norris, Anna Orr, Cassidy Perdue, Kathleen Perry, Sophia Philibaum, Morgan Price, Kiana Robinson, Shelby Rohr, Jenna Rothaker, Angelo Salvino, Camden Sandy, sorry, Selena Schaub, Thaddeus Schnecker, Jasmine Schuchert, Evan Shepard, Benito Shoup, Emmett Snyder, Grayson Snyder, Drew Stitt, Tyler Steyer, Sierra Sweat, Ali Vignos, Kendall Wagner, and Anthony Wilbur. I guess it's a good thing that we have so many names to read off for this honor. At this time, I will state the sophomores. Nicole Atkins, Abigail Allman, Kylie Allman, Myla Bishop, Zachary Bradford, Austin Brawley, Jason Bucklew II, Brittany Brzezinski, Lucas Berrick, Ayana Burns, Haley Burns, Kendra Kiriko, Vincent Crowder, Natalie Davis, Aaron Dingler, Caitlin Egan, Grace Erickson, Rachel Evanoff, Kirsten Falls, Aaron Fisher, Julius Frick, Cade Gardner, Molly Gatches, Jacqueline Geckler, Xavier Geisinger, Rihanna Gober, Madison Gratigen, Taylor Grant, Zoe Griffith, Jamie Grossweiler, Zachary Hamilton, Morgan Hannon, Isabella Herring, Imari Harris, Jada Harrison, Tristan Harder, Robert Harwig, 
Nicholas Hathaway, Samari Hattery Cunningham, Lativia Henderson, Kaylin House, Walker Huggins, Grace Knight, Andrew Kennan, Gabrielle Kring, Ramir Kyles, Aaliyah Lance, Crystal Lynn, Lisbeth Lopez, Delaney Mag, Catherine McCabe, Magdalena Mendoza Lopez, Kenneth David Merritt, Barbara Monroe, Ariana Moore, Kayla Murphy, Lauren Neal, Trinity Norman, Lexi Norris, Carly Palato, Ryan Paul, Lillian Perry, Tanner Pierce, Logan Popovich, Matthias Riggill, Xavier Rogers, Shane Rue, Dominic Salvino, Kelsey Samsel, Ray Schaub Jr., Alex Sebrel, Justin Shanklin, Aaron Shiplett, Alyssa Simmons, Alexandra Skylis, Shania Slaughter, Sophia Sorrell, London Squires, Caleb Stark, Madison Stoner, Summer Stur, Ayana Sullivan, Ezra Teal, Samuel Wurstler, Zachary Wilhelm, Dalen Williams, Laney Williams, Jaden Woods, Mia Woods, Rachel Wuske, and Courtney Yoder. Congratulations, sophomores. At this time, I will state the juniors. Nathan Albrecht, Diana Alexander, Xavier Andrews, Jaden Ballard, Morgan Barlow, Alex Bauer, Caitlin Beckett, Ariana Berry, Jaden Brown, Kaylee Brown, Zachary Catrone, Isaiah Clark, Mackenzie Copeland, Eric Coram Jr., Ryan Cottrell, Nathaniel Quarter, Liberty Crawford, Chevelle Croft, Essie Davis, Kayla Davis, Zachary Edwards, Abigail Evans, Aaron Fight, Tyler Friend, Kira Goodson, Nicholas Grassler, Cassie Green, Jacinto Gutierrez, Magnus Haynes, Madison Halter, Alexis Hamblin, Brooke Hamilton, Grant Hainum, Joseph Heinzer, Christopher Gerard Jr., Riley Jadell, Brianna Jenkins, Lexis Jennings, Kayvon Johnson, Antoinette Lackey, Zora Ladd, Jalen Leedy, Haley Liber, Nicholas Liebler, Jordan Ligel, Caitlin Lutz, Juliana Mattern, Jade Manley, Jackson Manweiler, Emily Maxheimer, Josie Maley, Leah Maley, David McCallicker, Isabella Miles, Amira Mitchell, Laveria Moore, Emma Moser, Jacob Orner, Haley Orr, Caden Patches, Ashley Patchen, Blaze Pat, James Perry Jr., Evan Peters, Alicia Feaster, Autumn Feaster, Mina Philpot, Cynthia Popovich, Terrence Rankle, Madeline Rerick, Cole Ryder, Celeste Rivera Holler, Madeline Rohr, Eliz Elizabeth Rue de Hoya Sanchez, Emily Ryder, Luke Sabo, Haley Samsel, Aiden Sandy, Bethany Santucci, Emily Short, Micaiah Smith, Nathaniel Smith, Brandon Snedeker, Aaron Spencer, Joshua Starcher, Vanessa Valentine, Paige Via, Jack Vignos, Davin Wenzel, Darian Williams, Lucian Williams, Reese Williamson, Kyra Woods, and Zariah Zachary. Congratulations, juniors. And to finish off, our honor roll students are our seniors tonight, and as you can see, quite a few of them, which is, again, a good problem to have. Sarah Adams, Owen Affolder, Anthony Alexander, Kristen Allman, Jack Bachtel, Dewana Banks Warren, Haley Beal, Cassidy Bowersox, Jamie Brom, Destiny Brewer, Keaton Brown, Lauren Brown, Madison Brown, Chancellor Burns, Carson Camacho, Jacob Campbell, Zane Caperton Wanger, Caleb Carey, Shaden Cheerson, Kiara Cleveland, Nick Conley, Jade Kahn. 
Joshua Critchfield, Charity Daly, Megan Davis, Autumn Davlin, Trinity Delad, Lauren Dingy, Megan Drexler, Anna Durzik, Makia Dooley, Trevor Farrell, Madison Fisk, Hannah Fry, Jasmine Garner, Alexandra Goff, Kariah Green, Chase Gresser, Cameron Grimm, Timothy Harper, Jonah Harder, Tyler Haug, Jordan Higgins, Emily Hilbert, Jaron Hodges, Preston Hodges, Devin Hose, Jaden Jeffrey, Bryce Johnson, Cole Jones, Lorinda Knight, Rachel Kleber, Gavin Crawl, Destiny Lambro, Dominic Leach, Olivia Ledger, Michaela Lee, Aiden Longwell, Caleb Mangus, Heath Manson, Morgan Manson, Nicholas Marple, Jacqueline Miseriegos Victorio, Benjamin MacArthur, Victoria McConnell, Devin McCummers, Peyton Mendenhall, Dylan Miller, Jaden Mitchell, Colton Mole, Luke Murphy, Olivia Musi, Emily Neal, Robert Page, Cable Patel, Michaela, Michaela Paul, Zoe Paulus, Anthony Pedro, Lila Ragab, Madison Ryman, Sydney Rice, Bailey Richards, Noah Richards, Gavin Robinson Samsel, Annabelle Rolig, Alejandro Salazar, Claudia Santos Vargas, Alexis Saunders, Marie Schiller, Hannah Schweier, Precious Schamberger, Alyssa Shannon Altoff, Jenna Schout, Destiny Shiflett, Ethan Smith, Genevieve Smith, Peyton Smith, Lauren Snedeker, Caitlin Snodgrass, Aurora Sorrell, Jaden Stock, Jade Stoke, Jada Stokes, Ethan Tobin, Lauren Turner, Peyton Wagner, Anastasia Wallace, Demi Ward, Madeline Wenzel, Destiny Wilson, Davin Woods, Christopher Wright, Connor Wesky, Gavin Yone, and Tabitha Young. Congratulations to all of our honor roll students. The state of Ohio sets criteria for students to earn an honors diploma that includes having a minimum 3.5 GPA or 27 or higher on the ACT, as well as having four years of college prep courses in English, math, science, and social studies, and can include arts, career tech, and foreign language. The following students have earned this distinction of having an honors, earning an honors diploma this year. Anthony Alexander, Kristen Allman, Emma Bachtel, Jack Bachtel, Haley Beal, Destiny Brewer, Keaton Brown, Lauren Brown, Caleb Carey, Shaden Cherson, Kira Cleveland, Charity Daly, Megan Davis, Autumn Davlin, Trinity Delayed, Anna Durzik, Makia Dooley, Madison Fisk, Hannah Fry, Madigan Hammer, Timothy Harper, Jonah Harder, Tyler Haug, Brooklyn Hogue, Lorinda Knipe, Rachel Kleiber, Aiden Longwell, Heath Manson, Morgan Manson, Nicholas Marple, Mackenzie Maxheimer, Benjamin MacArthur, Victoria McConnell, Devin McCumbers, Jaden Mitchell, Luke Murphy, Olivia Musi, Emily Neal, Robert Page, Jada Patterson, Michaela Paul, Zoe Paulus, Anthony Pedro, Madison Ryman, Sydney Rice, Bailey Richards, Noah Richards, Annabelle Rolig, Alejandro Salazar, Claudia Santos Vargas, Alexis Saunders, Hannah Schweier, Alyssa Shannon, Jenna Schelt, Genevieve Smith, Lauren Snedeker, Caitlin Snodgrass, Aurora Sorrell, Peyton Wagner, Demi Ward, Madeline Wenzel, Destiny Wilson, Davin Woods, 
Christopher Wright, and Tabitha Young. Congratulations to those seniors earning an honors diploma this school year. And at this time, I would like to welcome Mr. Craig McConnell to the stage. Good evening, everybody watching from home. Uh, the gifts to honors seniors will be shared with you by a video presentation with Mr. Eric Myers. Each year, the members of the Maslin Education Association like to recognize the seniors that have maintained the highest grades throughout their high school years. Your teachers are very proud of you and all of the accomplishments that you have achieved. Being recognized tonight are Emma Bachtel, Jack Bachtel, Haley Beal, Lauren Brown, Caleb Carey, Kiara Cleveland, Charity Daly, Hannah Fry, Madigan Hammer, Lorinda Knipp, and Morgan Manson, Heath Manson, Mackenzie Maxheimer, Benjamin MacArthur, Olivia Musi, Emily Neal, Anthony Pedro, Sidney Rice, Bailey Richards, Lawrence Snedecker, Caitlin Snodgrass, Aurora Sorrell, and Peyton Wagner. Congratulations to each of our highest honor seniors. Again, congratulations to the highest honor seniors. Next uh, is the presentation of the Struts and Frets Drama Awards. Uh, many of our students work behind the scenes and on stage gaining new experiences in theater. Mr. Myers and all involved wanted to, take, wanted to make sure that all students would be honored. Please enjoy the video by Mr. Eric Myers again. Congratulations to the members of the Struts and Frets Drama Club for a successful year. Each year, students work both behind the scenes and on stage, gaining new experiences in They are able to obtain thespian points. Being inducted into thespians this year are Miriam Joseph, Katie Perry, Addison Ferrero, Mackenzie Beggart, James Perry, Cheyenne Stokes, Evan Peters, Gerard. Congratulations to each received recognition previous years and have obtained additional points that are recognized on their induction certificate. Awards presented to members of the organization that are voted upon by the membership include Most Promising Freshman. This is an award for stage and backstage experiences. Receiving the award of Most Promising Freshman this year are three members. Maya McCullough, congratulations. Our Up and Coming Sophomore Award is also an award for both onstage and backstage experiences. And that award goes to Andrew Kennan, Lauren Neal, and Grace Erickson. The Bob Smith Memorial is in recognition of a Hall of Fame member who through the award that bears his name. This is for junior class members having worked either on stage or backstage or both. And this year's recipient is Brooke Hamilton. And now our recognition of seniors. Each of the seniors that have been involved in the theater program this year have taken on many leadership roles. Most notably among them receiving our leadership award is Zoe Paulus. For outstanding service, the Struts and Frets Drama Club would like to recognize Destiny Brewer. Congratulations to each of you. The Hall of Fame is a very distinguished honor voted by thespians only. Nominees are seniors who have attained thespian status and have been involved in drama throughout their high school experience for a minimum of three years. Recipients of this award will have a photograph of themselves and their theater experience framed and hung in the WHS Auditorium. The nominees for this award include Jaden Mitchell, Zoe Paulus, Cyan Gump, Caleb Carey, Caval Patel, Carson Camacho, Destiny Brewer, and Trevor Farrell. The thespians of the Struts and Frets Drama Club have voted to award the Hall of Fame 
to Cable Patel and Trevor Farrell. Congratulations, everyone. Next up, I will pre will be presenting the Washington High School Citizenship Award. Uh, the Washington High School Citizenship Award is awarded to the senior student possessing exceptional qualities in citizen citizenship, character, and honor. This year's award for outstanding citizenship goes to Jack Bachtel. Congratulations. Next up will be the Washington High School Leadership Award. The Washington High School Leadership Award honors one male and one female senior who, as a student leader, have a positive impact on the student body. This award is sponsored by the WHS administration and faculty. The students voted to have the highest leadership qualities are Caleb Carey and Lauren Brown. Congratulations. The next award is the Washington High School Activities Award. The Washington High School Activities Award is presented to one male and one female senior who participated in a variety of extracurricular activities. Uh, this year's recipients for 2020 are Cable Patel and Olivia Musi. Congratulations. Um, next, I'd like to welcome uh, back to the stage uh, Mrs. Renee Parr. I'm back to present some of the awards coming to us from the United States Marine Corps. The United States Marine Corps Awards for the class of 2020, we're first going to start out with the Scholastic Excellence Award. Marines have been recognized as the best military organization in the world. They earn that reputation because the Marines teach every new recruit the value of physical and mental strength. Mental strength comes through academic study. We encourage the nation's nation's youth to complete high school. We also offer every Marine several methods of going to college at our expense. I am honored to recognize the efforts of a special student. This student has demonstrated outstanding citizenship and leadership in academics. The United States Marine Corps takes pleasure in presenting the Scholastic Excellence Award to Caleb Carey. Congratulations, Caleb. The next award from the United States Marine Corps is the Semper Fidelis Award for Musical Excellence. It gives me great pleasure to be here to present the Semper Fidelis Award for Musical Excellence. The United States Marine Corps is proud to have the finest musical program in the world. The most notable organization of the program is the Marine Band, also known as the President's Own, from Washington, D.C. This prestigious musical organization was formed in 1798 and has played at every presidential inauguration since Thomas Jefferson's in 1801. The March King, the great John Philip Sousa, led the band for 12 years. The Marine Corps realizes that there would be no Marine band without dedicated young musicians. For this reason, the Marine Corps supports the high school band programs each year by awarding the Semper Fidelis Award. I'm honored to present this year's Semper Fidelis Award in recognition of diligence, dedication, and musical excellence as a performing high school band member. And this award goes to Jordan Higgins. Congratulations, Jordan. The last award presented by the United States Marine Corps is the Distinguished Athlete Awards. Since the United States Marine Corps was established over 242 years ago, they have enjoyed some of the most demanding physical standards in the world. They require their Marines to be in their absolute top physical condition in order for the Marine Corps to be successful in its missions. The Marine Corps realizes that the foundation for good physical fitness is laid in the high school athletic organizations. In addition to good training, habits, High school athletes are well aware of teamwork and discipline, two important elements in the makeup of a Marine. 
For this reason, the United States Marine Corps takes pleasure in supporting high school athletics by presenting the Distinguished Athlete Award. This year's recipients, who are recognized for displaying courage, poise, self-confidence, and leadership as a high school athlete are Ethan Tobin and Hannah Fry. Congratulations, Ethan and Hannah. And at this time, I would like to welcome to the podium Coach Nate Moore. Archie Griffin Sportsmanship Awards. In association with the integrity of the name of the two-time Heisman Trophy winner, Archie Griffin, the Ohio High School Athletic Association presents annually the Archie Griffin Sportsmanship Awards. They are given to a male and female student who have been outstanding in their efforts to promote sportsmanship in their school and community. The recipients are Aiden Longwell and Jacqueline Maziregos Victorio. OHSAA Scholar Athlete Awards. The Ohio High School Athletic Association recognizes a male and female scholar athlete of the year at each member's school in Ohio. The award is presented to the male and female student of that year's graduating class who have met the following criteria. One, the highest grade point average at the end of the first semester of the senior year. Two, received a minimum of four varsity letters. Three, in the event of a tie, the student with the most varsity letters will receive the award. This year's recipients are Heath Manson and Kiara Cleveland. OHSAA Courageous Student Award. This award is intended to bring credit to a very special student who has been involved in or supportive of the Interscholastic Athletic Program and who deserves recognition for courage and one of the following. One, a student who either currently has or who has overcome a serious illness, injury, or disability. Two, a student who has overcome great adversity in a positive way. Three, a student who has gone far beyond normal in assisting a fellow student, family member, or a friend. Four, other extraordinary situations where a student has displayed tremendous courage against overwhelming odds. This year's recipient is Lauren Brown. NFHS National Award of Excellence. Awarded to one male and one female senior student who has displayed exemplary sportsmanship ethics, and integrity. These students embody good citizenship, good moral character, and good sporting behavior. They are positive role models and encourage others to be positive role models. Our recipients are Robbie Page and Annabelle Rolig. The Timothy S. Sweaterlich Memorial Scholarship. The Tim Sweaterlich Scholarship was established to honor Tim's memory and his many accomplishments. Tim graduated from WHS in 1983 as valedictorian of his class. He was a two-way starter on the state runner-up football team. He excelled on the wrestling mat and his personal character was unmatched. After graduating high school, Tim attended the United States Air Force Academy where he played football and later served his country as a pilot of the F-15 fighter jet. At age 28, Tim was taken from us after a courageous battle with cancer. Beginning in 1994, a scholarship has been awarded to the WHS graduate who best epitomizes Tim's personal traits, specifically a strong academic record, 
high athletic achievement, and good personal character. We are pleased to announce Anthony Pedro as this year's winner. Like Tim, Anthony excelled in the, in the classroom and in athletics. Also, like Tim, Anthony played on offense and defense and, and plans to continue his football career in college. While Anthony is a strong choice for this award, the selection committee would like to acknowledge the other applicants for this scholarship. It is an impressive graduating class with more than a few worthy students. Congratulations, Anthony. Mayor's Scholarship. To present the Mayor's Scholarship, please enjoy this video with Mayor Kathy Catazzaro Perry. Good evening. My name is Kathy Catazzaro Perry, and I'm the proud mayor of the city of Maslin. Tonight is my honor and privilege to give the Mayor's Scholarship Award to one young lady. She's very impressive. She's been on the Maslin Tiger Swing Band for four years, student council for three years. She's a member of the National Honor Society as well as the National Technical Honor Society. She's been in the musical for three years, and she's also been in the girls' chorus as well as a Washingtonian. Tonight, I'd like to congratulate Demi Gabrielle Ward on winning the Mayor's Scholarship for Malone University. In addition, I'd like to congratulate all of our seniors and their parents and their families. This is a wonderful time in your life. Best wishes to all of you. Congratulations. Congratulations, Demi Ward. The Paul E. Brown Football Scholarship. The Paul E. Brown Football Scholarship is sponsored by the Maslin Rotary. This year's recipient is Anthony Pedro. At this time, please welcome Mr. David Lottenschlager to the podium. Maslin Tiger OB Scholarship. The Maslin Tiger Football Booster Club and the OB License Plate Scholarship Committee are pleased once more to award an OB License Plate Scholarship to three deserving seniors. The OB License Plate was the brainchild of Mary Struckel, a Washington High School alumnus, former Maslin Board of Education member, and the number one fan of the children of Maslin. It was Mary's idea of establishing a vanity license plate for our high school similar to many major colleges. What better symbol to put on a license plate acknowledging our Maslin Tigers than our OB mascot? We are the first high school in the nation to have this distinct distinction. A percentage of every OB plate registration is now dedicated to scholarships for our Maslin students. To date, we have awarded 18 $1,000 scholarships. This year's recipients have given their time and effort towards the Maslin Tiger football program. These recipients have also excelled in the classroom, shown leadership, dedication, commitment, and a work ethic that helped them achieve their goals. These attributes are consistent with the great Maslin tradition and have helped them in receiving this award. These attributes are consistent with the great masculine tradition, excuse me, and have helped them receiving this award. The OB License Plate Scholarship Committee is pleased to assist you toward your educational goals through this scholarship. This year's recipients have among their accomplishments grade point averages of 3.5 or better, one class valedictorian, and all are nominated for Outstanding Senior Boy. This year's recipients are Keith Manson, Anthony Pedro, and Noah Richards. James Burberry Memorial Scholarship. The James Burberry Memorial Scholarship 
was developed to honor James Burberry, who was a teacher at Washington High School until he passed away in 2017. Mr. Burberry loved being a teacher and cherished his years as the golf coach. Mr. Burberry strongly believed in pursuing a higher education. We are pleased to be awarding this scholarship to Timothy Harper. Timothy's multiple golf awards, engagement in school activities, and GPA were very impressive. We wish him the best at the College of Worcester. The James Burberry family, Cindy, Brooke, Brad, and Anthony. The recipient of the James Burberry Memorial Scholarship is Timothy Harper, Bob Wurstler Scholarship. This scholarship is open to any graduating senior from Washington High School who exhibits dedication and commitment to hard work and perseverance as a vehicle to success. Also, he will be, will be attending a two-year or four-year college or university as a full-time student. This year's recipient of the Bob Wurstler Scholarship is... Jonah Harter. Altcare Service and Leadership Scholarship. On behalf of Altcare Health Plans, I am honored to present the 2018 Altcare Service and Leadership Scholarship. The recipient of this scholarship must participate on a high school sports team and demonstrate how he or she is a service-oriented leader, either at school, on a sports team, or in the community. Altcare was fortunate this year to honor their scholarship recipients with a scholarship valued at $500. On behalf of Altcare, we are honored to present the 2020 Altcare Service and Leadership Scholarship to Alejandro Salazar. The William and Pearl Henderson Trust Fund the William and Pearl Henderson Trust Fund is a scholarship in memory of this couple who wanted to continue supporting the students of Maslin to further their education. Hard work, dedication, and the desire to succeed are just some of the qualities this year's recipients possess. This year's recipients of the William and Pearl Henderson Trust Fund scholarship are Destiny Brewer, Benjamin Creekbaum, Zoe Paulus, Aurora Sorrell, and Peyton Wagner. Guy B. Mabel Likens Scholarship. The Guy B. and Mabel Likens Scholarship is awarded to a high school senior who will be pursuing a bachelor's degree and who has maintained a GPA of 3.0 and who also is involved in community service. This $500 Likens Energy Award goes to Olivia Musi. Please welcome to the stage, Mr. Tony Thornsberry. The J. Richard Merchant Scholarship. The J. Richard Merchant Scholarship was established because of Mr. Merchant's love of baseball, his involvement in Little League, and his lifelong interest in academic excellence. This scholarship goes to a boy or girl who played in the Maslin Little League program and who currently ranks in the upper half of his, his or her graduating class. This year's recipient is Heath Manson. Congratulations, Heath. The 2020 Washington High School Alumni Scholarships. Please enjoy this video presented by Barb Hegel. All students will receive a $1,000 scholarship. The Washington High School Alumni Scholarship Fund was established in 1986 to provide scholarships to deserving seniors who desire to continue their education and accomplish the goals they set for themselves. The awards are granted to students who have excelled academically and have contributed to their school or community. The scholarship fund has steadily grown from its first donation of $85 to 
to its current values of approximately $550,000. The money comes into the fund from many sources. We receive donations from alumni, friends, past classes, memorials, bequests from estates, and fundraisers. These donations may range from $5 to $30,000. Starting in 1989 with one $350 scholarship award at the Distinguished Citizens Banquet, the awards have grown in size and in number. To date, 497 students have received scholarships totaling $492,820. This year, 26 students will receive a $1,000 scholarship. There are two scholarships named for individuals. One is the Gordon B. Williams Scholarship. Mr. Williams was, a rec was recognized as a distinguished citizen in 1994. The scholarship is given in his name to the student who performed the best in our application process. The second one is the Dorothy Sibula Blanche Scholarship. This scholarship was established by her family in her honor. Mrs. Blanche was not able to go to college, but she knew how important it was to have a college education. This scholarship must go to a woman, and because of the success of the scholarship fund, we can award two scholarships this year. Thank you to all those who have contributed to the scholarship fund. Our alumni fund needs to keep growing so that future Washington High School students will be helped with college expenses. On behalf of the Alumni Scholarship Committee, I want you to know that we are so very sorry that we were not able to recognize these students along with their parents in person at this Distinguished Citizens Banquet. The Washington High School Alumni Scholarship recipients for 2020 are Emma Bachtel, who received the Blanche Scholarship, Haley Beal, Lindsay Burke, who received the Blantz Scholarship, Lauren Brown, Kiera Cleveland, Autumn Davlin, Madison Fisk, Hannah Fry, Chase Gresser, Timothy Harper, who also received the Williams Scholarship, Lorinda Knipe. Heath Manson, Devin McCumbers, Peyton Mendenhall, Luke Murphy, Olivia Musi, Robert Page, Zoe Paulus, Anthony Pedro, Sydney Rice, Bailey Richards, Noah Richards, Claudia Santos. Vargas, Caitlin Snodgrass, Aurora Soral, and Connor Wuske. The 2020 Miss Massalonian, an outstanding senior boy, will receive an additional scholarship. Congratulations, seniors. We are so very proud of you. Please take time in the coming weeks to thank those who have influenced and inspired you in your education parents, family, teachers, coaches, directors, friends, or anyone who has made a difference in your education. I hope that wherever life takes you, that you always support our Masson City Schools. Be an active alumnus. There will come a time in your life when you will be able to give back to Masson Schools or donate to the scholarship fund as past alumni have for you. And always and always keep our tiger in your heart. Congratulations. Congratulations to the 2020 WHS Alumni Scholarship winners. The Maslin Rotary Scholarships. This video will present the recipients of the Maslin Rotary Scholarships by Sherry Brown, director of the Maslin Public Library. Greetings, Washington High School Class of 2020. What a year you've had. This is Sherry Brown. I'm the director of the Maslin Library, but I'm also past president of the Maslin Rotary Club and the chair of its scholarship committee. 
Mastlin Rotary is one of 3,500 clubs worldwide, part of Rotary International, a service organization that believes in service above self. So we choose students that we think cannot be successful just in life, but in giving back to the community. On behalf of President Keith Nutter, it gives me great pleasure to announce our 2020 scholarship winners. In alphabetical order here are Charity Daily, Jacqueline Mazariegos Victorio, Alejandro Salazar, and Christopher Wright. Congratulations, students. Congratulations to our Maslin Rotary Scholarship recipients. H.J. Chip Painter Award. The 2020 H.J. Chip Painter Leadership Award for $1,500 goes to Anthony Pedro, who is a leader on and off the court. Congratulations, Anthony. The Aaron Season Memorial Scholarship. Due to the deadline extension of this scholarship, winners could not be announced this evening. Mr. Season would like you to know that two winners will be selected from Washington High School for the Aaron Season Memorial Scholarship at a later date. The Stacy Helmrich Gardner Memorial Scholarship. The Stacy Helmrich Gardner Memorial Scholarship is awarded annually to one deserving graduating senior, senior from Madison Washington High School. Each recipient will receive $3,000. Stacy was a 1989 graduate of Washington High School who later received a bachelor's degree in psychology from Malone University and a master's degree in psychology from the University of Akron. Her, her work history includes stints at the Child and Adolescent Center, Fordyce and Associates, and the North Canton Medical Foundation. She became a licensed professional clinical counselor who focused on counseling children and married couples. She was loved by her clients for her empathy and skill, by, skill and by her colleagues for her attention to detail and professionalism. Stacy died from injuries sustained in a traffic ac accident in July of 2015. She was survived by her husband, Mike, her daughter, Michaela, her son, and her son, Nate. Stacy's parents, George and Jerry Helmrich, and her husband, Mike Gardner, were the first members of their respective families to attend and graduate from college. They saw and realized the opportunities that a higher education could afford an individual and his or her family. Stacy might not have attended college had her parents not attended before her. This is why they offer this scholarship, to give others the chance to be the first in their family to obtain a higher education. The Helmrich and Gardner families offer this scholarship in memory of their beloved daughter, wife, sister, mother, counselor, and friend, Stacy Helmrich Gardner. This year's applicants for the scholarship were outstanding. It was very difficult. It was a very difficult for the decision, uh, decision for the committee. The 2020 recipient of the Stacy Helmrich Gardner Memorial Scholarship is Jacqueline Mazariegos Victorio. Congratulations. Julian Memorial Scholarship. To present the Julian Memorial Scholarship, please enjoy this video with Mr. Max Julian. Hi, I'm Max Julian, and on behalf of the entire Julian family, I'd like to congratulate Benjamin Creekbaum on getting the Guy Julian Memorial Scholarship this year. Congratulations and best of luck. Congratulations to Benjamin Creekbaum, recipient of the Julian Memorial Scholarship. Charity Rotch Vocational Technical Scholarships. The Charity Rotch Vocational Technical Scholarships are awarded by the Charity School of Kendall to career tech education students who are continuing their education at a post-secondary institution. This year, eight students have won this scholarship award. The recipients are Anthony Pedro, Bailey Richards, Jacqueline Mazariegos Victorio, Heath Manson, Hannah Fry, Christopher Wright, Lauren Stoneman, and Noah Richards. The Jim Pinchak Memorial Scholarship. 
The Jim Pinchak Memorial Scholarship has been established to aid and honor outstanding high school students in career technical education. Out of 932 applications, we have a senior student that was awarded one of the 12 scholarships. The senior CTE student to receive this scholarship is Hannah Fry. At this time, I now welcome Mr. Dan Studer to the podium. Good evening. Our next scholarship is the Joe and Virginia Corral Scholarship. This scholarship is given in honor of former Maslin Tiger head football coach Chuck Mather by the Corral family. Coach Mather mentored the Tigers for six years, winning six Ohio championships, three national titles, and finished undefeated against Canton McKinley. Coach Mather passed away in 2006. This scholarship goes to a WHS senior who has earned at least one varsity letter and maintained a minimum 2.8 GPA. The award carries a two-time $5,000 value. The recipient of the Joe and Virginia Corral scholarship goes to Lauren Brown. Congratulations, Lauren. The, <clears throat> the Army Sergeant Corey Enlick Memorial Scholarship. The Corey Enlick Memorial Scholarship is given in memory of Army Sergeant Corey Enlick, who died from injuries sustained in Operation Iraqi Freedom. Corey was a 2003 graduate of Maslin Washington High School. He was assigned to the 2nd Squadron, 1st Cavalry Regiment, 4th Brigade, 4th Brigade, 2nd Infantry Division, Striker Brigade, Combat Team. This is the eighth year a student has won this scholarship honoring Corey. This year's recipient is Jada Stokes. Congratulations. The Maslin Education Association Teacher Scholarship. The MEA Scholarship Program, created by the Maslin Education Association, is aimed at assisting a single recipient who plans to pursue a career in education in Ohio by awarding a one-time scholarship of $500. To be eligible for the program, applicants need to be enrolled full-time in a teacher education program in an accredited Ohio post-secondary institution, have at least a 3.3 cumulative grade point average, and have an ACT or SAT score that meets or exceeds the national norm. This year's recipient is Anthony Pedro. Great job, Anthony. The Maslin Education Association General Ed Scholarship. The MEA scholarship program created by the Maslin Education Association is aimed at assisting a single recipient who plans to pursue a post-secondary education in Ohio by awarding a one-time scholarship of $500. To be eligible for the program, applicants need to be enrolled in a full-time college or university in an accredited Ohio post-secondary institution, have at least a 3.3 cumulative grade point average, and have an ACT or SAT score that meets or exceeds the national norm. This year's recipient is Caitlin Snodgrass. Congratulations, Caitlin. Maslin Lions Club Scholarship. The Maslin Lions Club is a part of the largest service organization in the world, Lions Club International. With over 46,000 clubs and over 1.4 million members serving in over 200 countries, our mission is to empower volunteers to serve their communities, meet humanitarian needs, encourage peace, and promote international understanding through Lions Clubs. Simply stated, our motto says it all, we serve. Founded in 1943, the Maslin Lions Club has spent over 75 years striving to meet the mission of Lions Club International. 
specializing in site conservation and assisting with the hearing impaired through countless fundraising programs, the Mass and Lions Club has raised hundreds of thousands of dollars for organizations and residents of the city of Maslin and surrounding areas. In addition, we oversee the operation and maintenance of the Lions Lincoln Theater, as well as the Lazy Eye Program, which screens all students in the city of Maslin for multiple vision impairments. The Maslin Lions Club has developed this scholarship to provide a small amount of financial relief, but more importantly, to recognize a student that has a passion and understanding for community service and that represents what we as Lions look for and strive to achieve every day. Congratulations to the 2020 Masson Lions Club Scholarship winner, Emma Bachtel. Congratulations, Emma. The J. M. and M. Scholarship. The J. M. and M. Scholarship Foundation is committed to supporting the college dream providing books and supplies to low-income, college-bound students. This scholarship is awarded to one senior from either Maslin Washington High School or McKinley Senior High School every year. We are proud to announce this year's recipient, as well as another victory over the Bulldogs. An award of $600 goes to Lauren Brown. Great job, Lauren. The Relda Roth Scholarship. Relda Skip Roth, a very proud graduate of Washington High School in 1945 and longtime educator in the Maslin City School District from 1961 to 1979. She was an English teacher at Lauren Andrews and also at Washington High School. Because of her value of education, she wanted to continue her tradition of education to Maslin Washington High School students pursuing higher education and therefore establishing a scholarship in her memory. Winners for the Relda Roth Scholarship are Charity Daly, Alejandro Salazar, and Jonah Harder. Great job, guys. Congratulations. At this time, I'm going to welcome to the stage, welcome back to the stage, Mr. Craig McConnell. Good evening once again. Um, the next scholarship will be the Shelley Materials Incorporated Scholarship. Um, the Shelley Company is proud to offer college scholarships uh, to graduating high school seniors near our operations across the state of Ohio. Um, there's a few things that students have to do in order uh, to be up for this scholarship. Uh, must have a minimum grade point average of a 3.5 on a 4.0 scale, and must attend high school supported by the 2020 Shelley uh, Company Community Scholarship in 2020. Uh, this year's Community Scholarship uh, winners are Charity Daly. Congratulations. Next is the Janice Ferosis Grove Scholarship. Um, Janice was a 1978 graduate of Washington High School. She graduated from the University of Akron and obtained her master's degree um, from Miami University. Janice was a teacher in the Worthington School System. Um, her scholarship is awarded to a student who is planning a, a career in education. Uh, this year's winner um, is Anthony Pedro. Congratulations. Next is the Natalie McConnell Gravel Memorial Nursing Scholarship. Uh, please enjoy this video that was made by Gretchen Kamer, who is the daughter of Natalie, um, and she will speak to what this scholarship actually means. My name is Gretchen Kamer. I'm the daughter of Natalie Gravo. Before Natalie was a Gravo, she was a McConnell. We are here virtually to present the first annual Natalie McConnell Gravo Memorial Scholarship. I'd like to tell you a little bit about Natalie. Natalie and her six siblings were born and raised here in Maslin. She was very proud to have been in the first graduating class from Whittier Elementary in 1939. Natalie graduated from Washington High School in 1951. She went on to become a registered nurse in 1954 and returned to college and received her Bachelor of Science in Nursing from The Ohio State University in 1964. 
Natalie married Richard Gravo. Together, they raised four children. My brothers, Rick and Pete, my sister, Cassie, and myself. The majority of her 40-year career was spent at Masson Community Hospital, eventually becoming the director of nursing. My mom was quite the pioneer, as most women did not work outside the home. She was very proud to be a nurse. She was well-liked and well-respected by many. Natalie loved many things, our century-old hobby farm, raising chickens, even in the dining room, collecting antiques, traveling abroad, many vacations at the Outer Banks, baking cookies at Christmas, making delicious baklava, and Maslin Tiger football. My parents were season ticket holders for over 50 years. She had a lot of fun throughout the years. She ate her first walking taco at 84, and she really liked it. As you can see, my mom was vibrant to the very end. When my mom knew her remaining time with us was short, she said, I'm not sad, I've had a marvelous life. She had many visitors and made grown men cry. She was so uplifting and gracious, even at the end. I had a conversation with my mom about a nursing scholarship in her memory. She was always a proponent of furthering your education. She loved the idea and wanted it to be directed toward two groups that she felt very tied to, nursing and the Maslin Tigers. The Gravo family is proud to present the 2020 Natalie McConnell Gravo Memorial Scholarship to Demi Ward. Demi will be pursuing her Bachelor of Science in Nursing at Malone University. Congratulations, Demi. Natalie would be very proud. We wish you the very best. Again, congratulations, Demi, um, on receiving this scholarship. Next will be the Klein Memorial Scholarship. Uh, please en enjoy this video uh, on the first presentation of the Klein Memorial Scholarship. On behalf of Rodney Klein, pictured here, and the Board of Trustees of the Klein Museum, I'd like to congratulate Emma Bachtel, Heath Manson, Sidney Rice, and Timothy Harper on receiving the first Rodney Klein Memorial Scholarships. Rodney was passionate about education, business, and especially the stock market. We also become passionate about your education and your chosen career. Please visit us at the museum when this quarantine is lifted. We'd love to meet you and personally congratulate you on your accomplishments. Best of luck to you and all the 2020 graduates. Thank you. Again, congratulations to Emma Bachtel, Heath Manson, Sidney Rice, and Timothy Harper. Next is the Grace Spencer Memorial Scholarship. Um, during his many years working in the Madison City School District, Mr. Greg Spencer touched the lives of countless student, students and co-workers. He was a custodian at York Elementary in the Massa Middle Schools and groundskeeper at MIS. He also served as president of our local OPSI uh, 114 for nearly 20 years. Mr. Spencer gave his time, his knowledge, and his energy to help students of all ages. Nothing, nothing pleased him more than to help a young person in need. Unfortunately, this past December, Mr. Spencer passed away following a brief illness. He was so well respected by the staff across the district that a collection was formed to honor his legacy at the Masson City Schools. OPC members who included custodians, bus drivers, cooks, librarians, and teachers unions, as well as members of the MEA's teachers union. Um, contributed to, one, the, to a one-time Greg Spencer Memorial Scholarship to be awarded to a graduating senior. On behalf of all the contributors, and as a representative of the OPSI 114, I am very pleased to award Jaden Mitchell with the Greg Spencer Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $1,800. Jaden will be attending the University of Toledo, studying mechanical engineering. Jaden received exceptional recommendations from her teachers, and her academic achievements more than qualify her for this award. OPSI and MEA wish Jaden the very best of luck in her college career. Again, congratulations, Jaden. Next up is the Kenny R. Walkup Senior Memorial Scholarship. Um, our next video will be Mr. Kenny Walkup Jr. presenting the Kenny R. Walkup Senior Memorial Scholarship.
Good evening, and congratulations to all those being honored tonight, as well as their families, WHS staff and administration. My name is Kenny Walkup Jr., and I'm a 1987 graduate of Washington High School. My father, Kenny R. Walkup Sr., was a passionate fan of Tiger Athletics. At one time or another, he was a member of the football, wrestling, and basketball booster clubs, serving as president of the basketball booster club. He was a vocal and respectful cheerleader, traversing the state of Ohio to watch his Tigers play. He could regularly be found at home games of Maslin Tiger basketball, initiating the TIG chant from the court as he would greet the home team. My father and my mother, Sue, had season tickets for Maslin Tiger football for well over 30 years, and Kenny could regularly found at the gym watching the Tiger basketball team play. My father, Kenny, passed away in January of 2020 from complications of a stroke. To donate money to establish a scholarship for a graduating high school senior basketball player. This year, my family is proud to present a scholarship to graduating senior Anthony Pedro. Anthony submitted an essay on key lessons learned in his sport, as well as from a coach and trusted mentor on life lessons that he can apply off the court. The Walk Up family congratulates Anthony Pedro on winning the 2020 Kenny R. Walk Up Senior Memorial Scholarship Award and wishes him continued success as he pursues his education at Wittenberg University. A gift of $1,000 is being made to support Anthony's education in my father's name. Congratulations to Anthony and all the winners tonight. Again, congratulations, Anthony, um, on winning that scholarship. Next will be the Coach Nick Verosis Memorial Scholarship. Uh, this is the first time that uh, Coach Nick Verosis Memorial Scholarship will be offered. $500 will be uh, given to one football player and one basketball player in which the coaches select. Nick Verosis was a native of Martins Ferry who served his country as a United States Marine from 1944 to 1946. Then went on to play both football and basketball at the University of Alabama. Verosis started his coaching career um, at Dillonvale High School before going to Dover in 1955. After three years as an assistant football and head boys basketball coach for the Tornadoes, he arrived in Masson in 1958 to coach centers and guards under coach Leo Strang. Verosis and his wife, Jerry, never left Maslin, their home for 60 years. He spent 33 years as an assistant football coach for the Tigers under eight head coaches. And a 10 year run from 1960 to 70 as the head boys basketball coach. Coach Ferocious was a proud Ohio State Athletic uh, Committee man for both Woody Hayes and Earl Bruce. This year's winner, Emmanuel McRoy and Jaden Stock, congratulations. Next, um, please welcome back to the stage our head principal, Mr. Dave Lautenschlager. To conclude this evening's honors program and awards assembly, is now the eagerly anticipated announcement of the Miss Massalonian candidate, as well as our outstanding senior boy candidate. Just to go through the selection process and how this particular uh, program works and goes through for those of you at home that do not know or are not aware, to be eligible for Miss Massalonian, an outstanding senior boy, students must have a minimum of a 3.3 grade point average and have less than 24 absences and 10 tardies through their junior year. Once eligibility is determined, the students then receive points for student activities, teacher evaluations, an impromptu essay, and popular vote. From that process, the top 12 girls and top 12 boys participate in a formal assembly and interview process 
where they are judged by members of the community. This year's participants in the top 12 girls, I will just read them alphabetically, are Emma Bactel, Haley Beal, Lauren Brown, Kiara Cleveland, Madison Fisk, Hannah Fry, Olivia Musi, Sydney Rice, Bailey Richards, Annabelle Rolig, Genevieve Smith, and Caitlin Snodgrass. Congratulations to our top 12 girl nominees. This year's participants in the top 12 boys were again as follows in alphabetical order. Owen Affolter, Jack Bachtel, Caleb Carey, Timothy Harper, Jordan Higgins, Heath Manson, Nick Marple, Ben McArthur, Luke Murphy, Caval Patel, Anthony Pedro, and Noah Richards. Congratulations to our top 12 boy nominees for Outstanding Senior Boy. At this time, I will name the top five girls in no particular order. Lauren Brown, congratulations. Kiara Cleveland, congratulations. Olivia Musi, congratulations. Sydney Rice, congratulations. And Caitlin Snodgrass, congratulations to our top five female Miss Macedonian candidates. At this time, I will also name the top five boys in no particular order as well. Jack Bachtel, Caleb Carey, Timothy Harper, Benjamin McArthur, and Anthony Pedro. Congratulations to our top five boys for Outstanding Senior Boy in no particular order. Congratulations to all of our finalists. And I feel like this is the time in most TV shows where we can go to a commercial break. So I will save you that trouble because I will now present our 2020 Miss Massalonian and Outstanding Senior Boy. Congratulations to Lauren Brown and Caleb Carey. Congratulations to those students. They have represented us well, as have all of the candidates within this, this, this pool of candidates for this evening, and also the candidates that have been recognized throughout this particular evening. As we close tonight, as we close tonight, I would just like to say just a few remarks as we move forward through this time, and in particular in the students' lives as they move forward throughout their collegiate working and professional careers. Tonight is a night to recognize the hard work also and commitment that your parents have made to you. I know that many of you are at home, you're sitting next to them, and you're hearing this message loud and clear. And as one parent speaking to students who are sitting next to their parents, the endless sacrifices and dedication that we as parents and that your parents have made to helping you become what you have become to this point is a tribute to the love and the sacrifice that they have and that we have for you. Please turn to them. Please say thank you and tell them that you love them for all of the unending nights and commitments and dedication they have made to the success of you as a young person. Hopefully they have laid the foundation for you moving forward in your personal and professional lives as well. For students, especially those that are receiving scholarships this evening from community and from people and the local organizations that have given you these opportunities and the financial resources to make your dreams come true, be thankful. Send thank you notes and express your gratification as necessary for the investment that they are making in your future. 
the biggest gift that you can make as a student to all of these people, the organizations, and the, uh, the people that have contributed to your success financially from this evening, the best investment that you can make for them, and I think I speak for all the adults that have given these resources to you, work hard, be productive, be respectful, and always pay it forward as you achieve your goals. There are gonna be many people in your life they will try to take your high standards as students and as people, and they will try to drag you down and pull you down to their level. I resist you from doing that, and I, resi I hope that you keep your high standards high, always, as you move forward throughout your life. It has been an honor and a blessing to bring this honors program to you in this particular manner, in a live format. I am thankful to you as a community I am thankful to you as students. We love you. Go Tigers. And as always, God bless.